Hello, my name is Mindy for Mindy's Crafts and Cash. Welcome to episode five of Glue With Me in my A, B, C, B, C, Blue Book. Now, uh, on another video, I made these cute little holders to hold the letters, and to hold my, to hold my images that I'm going to be pasting in today. And we'll see how they work out. So they're in alphabetical order. Um, hopefully everything will go in nice and smoothly. So let's start with the A, B selection. Okay. I had made these based on um, Marguerite from Seven Plaza on YouTube channel. It was her most watched video to make these little, whatever these are called, booklet things or little holders. And I made them my own a little bit by putting the alphabet on them and we'll see how it all works out. So I'm gonna call this A for apartment building, angel and B for bloom. So let's get the A's done. And just using my glue stick here. And I actually have three A pages, just the way I started the book, because I wanted the letters facing each other. So this is A and this is A. Really having fun working in this book. I use stickers. Uh, these are punch outs from a book by Art by Marlene. Uh, this is from a Stamperia is the name of the brand, one of their books. And B for B Bloom. It's a pretty word. Pretty the way they did it. Put it right here. Okay, now let's see if we had anything in the C, D. Just have one, we have chickens. Oh, or if I turn it over, we have a cow. Well, they would both go on the C page, but I like all these chickens. It's also a rooster, but too bad he doesn't get on his own page. I'll put it, we'll start on the other page. There we go. So we were down south outside a casino and we saw a chicken and a lot of little baby chickens walking with her and then a big rooster strutted up to her. I will try to put some uh, videos of it. It really was very interesting. It was a whole little family. Okay, I didn't have anything in the D. Let's see if I had anything on the E or the F. I do. I have family and a flip-flop. So let's go to the F page and nothing for E today. Nice little family. And a flip-flop. This was a sticker that I put on glitter paper and then I colored over. Give it a little angle here. Oop, went sliding. Okay, so we finished F and E. And let's see if we have anything in GH. We do, what's coming out? A house. Let's see if I already had a house. I did have a house, but we will put another one right up here. Page is filling up. Okay, so I finished this this one. And let's see if I can find the other ones. We'll put it back so we can use it again. Okay, let's see if that I and J. I do have a few. I have ice cream again. 
I already had ice cream and I have Istanbul. I'm gonna so just a sticker. I'm gonna stick it over here. I like it on the pink. And Istanbul. Found an I word. And since I got a little glue right there, we'll not put it there though. <laughs> God, sometimes I amuse myself. Have to make yourself laugh. And Jay, we have joy, and now we have journey. Right to the edge there. Okay. Now let's. See. Oh, and I have one more. I put it in the back there. I have jars. This was a stamp, and then I pretty much colored it in. Okay, so that's J. Let's see if we have anything for K. Nope, just an L, a lamp. Go right to L. And now M, N, see I have some in here. A little hard to get out when your fingers are getting sticky. Okay, these are called macarons, uh, the French pastries. And I think we're gonna put them right on the mesh so my cute guy can eat some. Here, have one, honey. It's just for you. Hi, cute guy. Okay, now let's see what we have in the O and the P. I have a present, a paintbrush, and a pillow. And something else is in there. Let's see what it is. The letter, the word one, and a puzzle piece. Okay, we've got a lot here. So let's first go to O. And put the word one. As you can see, I'm working really hard <laughs> to get the O's. Put that right here. And all the rest from that section are in the P's. So I kind of wanted to try to straighten this piece out, but I'll do that off camera. I don't know if I can without ripping the whole page, which I don't want to do. So here we have a pillow. I probably got that from my HGTV magazines. The subscription's over, but I really enjoyed those. And the puzzle piece, obviously I can't put here, you wouldn't see it. So we'll put it over here. And a present, who doesn't love a present? Nice, pretty present. And boy, I never wrap anything like that anymore. It's gift bags and a little bit of paper put in it. And a oopsie daisy paintbrush. I think I'm going to put the paintbrush right across here. And then we're done with this section. Okay, let's put it back to use again. Now we have the last section. It starts with Q, and I know I don't have anything for Q. Let's see if uh, or R. Okay. For S, I have scissors. I have nothing for UV. And W, X, Y, Z, I have a window. So just two more. I'm gonna put the scissors on the other page. Oh, there's middle areas to punch out, which I didn't punch out. Let's do that. This was also from that art by Marlene punch out book okay there we go with that 
give it a little more glue. <laughs> Everything's sticking to my fingers. And W, window, pretty window. I love that window box. Don't have one, but I love it. I'll put that right here. And now this is done. So it made it much easier to just have everything in alphabetical order. Now, I believe I may have a couple others that I had no room for. And yes, I do. Okay, so let's look at these. Here's a tree. It didn't really fit in there. So let's go back to T. Give it a nice tree. This was also a punch out. And I have uh, I think this is supposed to be a llama. Now I'd said when I made the book, because I made it with loose leaf, there's plenty of room for it to expand, and I can always put it into a, a different loose leaf that has bigger rings. So I'm really not uh, confined to the size of the book. Whoops, I just want to get this sticky piece off and paste this llama on. I think I'm going to have to do that off camera. And I also have iced tea and the tree. That's it. Okay, that would be it for today. So let's do these. Finish up. These drinks are really popular in Florida. It's hot here. Iced tea, iced coffee. Yummy, yummy. Mm -mm -mm. Nice and refreshing. And let's just go put on that llama. And he just has a little bump here. We're not going to worry about that too much. And it's a happy llama. Thank you so much for watching. Please like and subscribe. Another episode will be in a few days as I collect more images to put in the book. Have a great day. Keep crafting, keep budgeting, keep to your goals, and take care. Bye-bye.